Hello everyone, welcome back. I just want to show you guys a recent update from the mod Matilija Aerospace. For those who don't know, it is a pretty awesome mod with new higher end luxurious looking parts. I just did a build with this mod. You can see it in the background and I put a link below. The author came up with a new update and it brought in a couple of new parts. But one in particular, I want to give you guys a tour of that part because it's pretty amazing. It is the CPS 500 bridge command and it is huge. It is a massive cockpit. I am going to take you guys to see the interior, so don't worry about that. But first, I just want to give you guys a quick look at the part. So it is a two levels and you have different variants. So you have this one with two center entrances, but then you also have this one where kind of you have a ramp going to the first floor or to a second floor. And then another one in the top floor that goes just straight. Then there is another one that kind of does it this way. And there is this one where you basically have all access from the top, all three of those. And I think below it is just access in the middle one, not the two on the side, it's just this one. I think it is one of the biggest cockpit you can get aside from the Starborn ship. It is a pretty interesting cockpit, I gotta say. I think the interior looks better. I'll try to come up with a design using this cockpit. But let's go to the inside. Just really quick before we go in, this is how it looks like from the bottom. I look at those lights. I really like those lights. That's a lot of lights. That's a lot of lights. Okay, let's go inside. And I just snapped the parts in this previous build that I have. I didn't do anything particular to try to make it look good or anything. I just want to show you guys the interior. So this is the ramp. No more ladders, no more stairs. And this is the cockpit. I mean, check it out. It's pretty massive. You have this whole kind of Star Trek type of thingy going on here, I think. So you have co-pilot seats, two, you know, one on each side. And then you have your pilot seat. And all this, this whole floating thing, it looks pretty cool. I like it. It's pretty nice. And let's see, so you have now one door that leads straight. So this is how the hallway, the neck kind of looks like. And that goes to a regular half that I have. And on the other entrance, so this is another ramp that can lead to another hub basically. And if you use, you know, the different, the different variants, then, you know, you will have this either going up or the other one going down, etc., etc. So, and once you go down here, so there is a, what is this call thing? A control thingy station navigation panel or something like that. And you have a bunch of, what is it called? These things. And you can sit in there or at least, at least your crew members, they can sit. Now there is, I think an invisible wall here. I'm not too sure what it is. It's my, my head is not hitting anything, but there is an invisible wall that you kind of have to go around it. I'm not sure, not too sure what it is. Same thing here. So, you know, nothing major It's just a little thing here that is, looks like invisible, um, that you cannot go straight and you cannot have to go around it. So just that and massive windows. And of course, if you want, you can jump to your second uh, level, second platform. And you have all the consoles here. So there's the army Larry, there is your cargo hold. And on the other side, you have the captain's locker. And you can also, of course, decorate as well. So you could put anything that you want. Now, I know that uh, one of you, one of my viewers loves to put toilets inside the cockpit uh, and as a joke. And guess what? There is now building restroom in this cockpit. So this one's for you, buddy. And uh, yeah, that is, that is the interior of this. I see a lot of space. I think if you do interior decoration, this is one of the few cockpits that I think there is plenty of space for you to put some uh, cool stuff around and um, uh, do, you know, something. 
So that is the cockpit. And it's pretty amazing. It's pretty good. I think the author did a really good job here creating this humongous cockpit because we just don't have one in this game, except for the starboard ship. And just really quick, there's also new parts in addition to that cockpit. And one is this one, the large captain's quarters, two by two. There's also this, I think it's a three by three modifiable engineering bay. And then just a couple of variants of some of the previous half that came with the mod. For example, this one, the one by three. So we have the one by two and now there is a one by three. So it's all the same. It's just, you know, a little bit longer. And I also see that there are a couple of variants for the, for the cross passage. So there's this one. And now you also have this one without the glass. Then there is a side to side or a front to back cross brace. There's also a new ramp as well that you can kind of switch. Uh, if I'm not mistaken, there's also a new structure part as well. I think it's this one. This is the Matilija, the four nose. I think this is new. I don't remember this structure before. I'll take you guys now to see the other new hubs that the author updated. The new, I haven't seen it yet. Okay, so this is the captain's quarters. This is the new two by two captain's quarters from Atelija. Very, very much like Stroud actually. So it is, looks like it is based on Stroud, the interior but with a couple of uh, furniture decorated. So I guess, you know, if you like something minimalistic, then this could work for you. But otherwise, of course, you can always decorate it even further. So this is just a look for you guys. And looks like you also have the consoles for the bounties and things like that. So that's pretty nice that is in here. You have all the consoles. And now let's go to, I think this is now the engineering room, the three by three one. It's pretty, pretty cool. Personally, I'm not a big fan of engineering rooms, but I could totally see this kind of work in a, in a design. It is pretty big. It is a three by three, but yeah, it is pretty cool. This is the three by three massive engineering room. Computer access also works. It doesn't have anything, but it works. It's pretty nice. I do like this thing in the middle, this kind of control station smacked in the middle of the engineering room. So, all right, just a really quick view of the interior of these two new hubs as well. And this is just a quick video to showcase the latest update from Matilija Aerospace. And I'm going to try to see if I can come up with a design for, for the cockpit. And if I do, obviously, you guys can expect a video. So, all right, that is it. Just a really quick, short video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Please don't forget to like and subscribe. Help me support this channel. Other than that, thank you all for watching. Enjoy the game, have fun, and I'll see you all in the next video.